Rudin for us is a platform to test our technologies and this is part of the supporting the innovation for, for our research center. We have been very busy developing new technologies and also invite new technologies to be tested on board. They got the opportunity to go out there and study sea ice, first of all melt year ice and also icebergs, which is a part of input to their numerical studies, theoretical development and so on. As for, for them, it was very, very valuable and so for industry as well. These uh, moorings will give us some very valuable information about the current uh, in the area, the speed and the direction of the current uh, and, uh, and also the, uh, the frequency and the, the number of the, uh, the ice and the icebergs, uh, ridges uh, in, in the ice uh, that's passing through these uh, locations. This is especially an area of interest for us because in the Barents Sea, as we normally say, we have plenty of first year ice and some icebergs. Not much of second year and melt year ice. But over closer to Greenland, in this area we have been now, we have plenty of second year and melt year ice. That's stronger, harder and thicker. And we need to design our models also to account for those conditions. And those we doesn't find to that level in the Barents Sea. And it also resembles what you find in Alaska, Canada, Beaufort, Canada, and uh, that's of high value for us. Adol's objective for this cruise was to contribute to the general knowledge of the area, to North East Greenland, knowledge on biology there, mainly marine biology, and that was more or less the classical uh, marine observer work. But we are also interested in developing better techniques for marine mammal detection. That is an important issue for oil industry as well, to be sure that there are no marine mammals in areas where we do possibly dangerous uh, actions. The objective in terms of the acoustics in this trip was to uh, record the ambient so sound, the ice breaking noise, the uh, ship noise, the marine mammal sounds uh, to have a better idea of how sound propagates under uh, ice. This is something to our knowledge that has not been uh, yet done and uh, this is something that we needed to do to uh, uh, have a better idea of how to manage uh, the future activity is in, in the area. We all know that noise is an issue, uh, noise effect uh, has uh, problems for the marine fauna and getting this, this data was something that was very, uh, very important. All these technologies, putting them together, understanding how they work and also have a theoretical uh, scientific approach to them, that will give a lot of input to how we should plan operations in the future. Mm -hmm. 